This video will show you how to back up any work on your computer and also show you how to back up your iPhotos library. Before I show you, I want to reiterate that you should be doing your work in Google Drive and that if you are doing your work in Google Drive, it's automatically saved and backed up. The process I'm about to show you is the process you should use for any files that are on your computer and nowhere else. What you're going to do is insert your um, flash drive or hard drive USB into one of the slots on your computer and when you do that eventually on your screen a little icon will pop up to represent the external hard drive or flash drive. You can see mine just appeared right here. You can even rename these items if you hold the control button and click it and then hit rename. You can rename it something like Mr. Barry's um, hard drive or Mr. Barry's flash drive. Now to back up you're going to open that window. I've got nothing in this right now as you can see or maybe a little bit and then what I'm going to do next is I'm going to click go home. When I have these two windows open I am going to first show you how to do how to back up your documents. What I would do is make a new folder in your hard drive. To make a new folder you can click the gear icon new folder and call it backup and then open that folder and then open your documents folder. Any documents or folders that you have you can now drag to your backup. So for example if I wanted to back up this particular item I would drag it here and it would go. The larger the files, the larger the folder, the longer it's going to take to back up. And again, you can do this with a folder as well. And if you have a lot of stuff, that process will take a while. So that's how to back up your documents. In terms of pictures, you're going to, instead of choosing documents, you're going to choose pictures. And then what you want to drag over is Photos Library, and that will back up your photos. Again, this process will take a while if you have a lot of photos. You can also drag over specific folders of photos that you have if you've made anything like that. The last thing you might want to back up is your music. So when you go to the Go menu, or your movies, to back up your music, You're going to go to the iTunes folder, iTunes Media, Downloads, and drag that folder into your backup. Also, your music and podcasts, if you have those as well. If you have movies that you want to back up, you can do that by dragging over the iMovie library. So that's how to back up your work. Uh, your movies, your music, and your photos.